I had a friend, Sean Weiss, who was uh, Goldberg the Goalie from the Mighty Ducks movies, and he was also in Heavyweights. And uh, he got a hold of Judd Apatow. He was like kind of, uh, Sean was my kind of my first big supporter. And we did stand up together, and he got a hold of Judd Apatow and got me an audition for this after I heard about it. And we tried to get an audition for a couple weeks. And I had an audition and had nine auditions for the part, and uh, it was just crazy. We got it. Um, yeah, I, I had done one movie prior to this one, and it was called It's Kind of a Funny Story with Zach Galifianakis, and so originally they told me that I had too much experience to even audition because they wanted strictly unknowns only. Um, but anyway, after some convincing, I decided to email um, Zach Galifianakis and ask him to put in a good word with Todd, and uh, ended up coming back in and, and reading with Todd again and, and several more times, and, uh, and eventually, finally, uh, we all got cast. So and cool. just did an open call over the yeah. internet. They, had, they saw like, a, I don't know, thousands of people. So I don't know what I did that was so awesome, but I appreciate it. Disneyland. Yeah, yeah. yeah we took a, we, we, uh, we went to a Big Bear, spent a weekend in Big Bear. Uh, yeah, just a lot of hanging. I mean, after a while, it was easy because yeah. we like we liked hanging out. These with are each some, other. these are like my two best friends. Yeah, thank you. We just thank hang out with them all the time. We yeah. we uh, we also had something in common where this was like a big thing for all of us, including Nima too. You know, it was all it felt like a big break for all of us, and uh, we kind of had that in common. So that really helped build a friendship. You know, you had something to relate to. Yeah, I mean, if one of us had been an established actor, the dynamic just would have been totally off. Yeah, so it was cool. So we were jumping off from the same point, like all yeah. of us. Deep end swimming, you know. Yeah. Pretty much what it looks like, I feel <laughs> like, is yeah. what it was like to be there. Um, Exhilarating was, and exhausting. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it was intense. We had, you know, 300 extras there, and a lot of they would bring the same ones back every night for, for five weeks, and so they started to, you know, get to know each other, and eventually it was like a real party mentality, and uh, that and it was really felt like a party environment. And you met so many cool people and, like, so many, like, really cool guys and so many beautiful women with, like, not an ounce of cellulite on them, and it was crazy. <laughs> Like just the like how you'd get attention from these these extras on set who made the party so yeah. great. One thing I I, I thought was so funny when we were shooting it is this guy and he's throwing up into the toilet and then there's these kids that are just pissing like he's not even there into the toilet, like past his head, or onto his head. Too far, and man. It was just so real looking Too far. and disgusting. We just, like, couldn't I was just it. thinking about one that they get in there, which was uh, this dude hanging from the, the ceiling. I think he was hanging from like the chandelier. the chandelier, like this huge chandelier. He was like shaking, and like he was a stunt guy, but like I think he was a stunt guy, and it was like crazy to watch this dude fall and like uh, tear that thing off the wall. I, that made it into the movie, I think. We had some really, it. really impressive yeah. stunt guys. Yeah, the stunt guys were incredible. My stunt guy was <laughs> hilarious because there's not a lot of young stunt dudes in my body type, so it's it's someone that started off doing stunts in great shape when they were younger. So my stunt guy was probably in his 60s, and he had done the original Texas Chainsaw Massacre. So seeing him put on the, the curly hair wig and uh, falling off the treadmill and jumping off the house was really just yeah. pretty incredible. He was hilarious. 